is it? Powered hovercraft. Excellent. Let's have a look inside then. Here's the instructions. Yep. It's complicated inside. Mm -hmm. Warnings. Yes, shouldn't be used by children under 36 months old. I think you're old enough. Switch it on now. Probably not it Whoa, that's right. But we haven't finished yet. Try it in the kitchen. Whoa. It's going a bit better, isn't it? There you go, it's coming back to you. 
but it's eating up those batteries. Summary time. What do I think of it? Borderline. It does work, but I'm not happy with it. Um, they've tried to make it as simple as possible, the construction, and yeah, I don't like it. I just, that's all I can say, really. I don't like it. It does work. In fact, it goes in a nice straight line with these nice fins on the back. Borderline power, as soon as the battery starts to run down, then it doesn't hover anymore, it starts to drag. I've no doubt an easy fix would be to put a LiPo battery in there, and it would be fine. Those, um, the skirt, the balloon skirt thing, that's too much fuss, I couldn't get that to work. The idea is it's um, polythene tubes that go all the way around. And then you point the ends of the tubes into the hole here, and the idea is they fill up with air. But I couldn't get that to work. I'm, I expect if I spent more time it might, but I couldn't, couldn't be bothered. It does work like that, so that's good enough. Grandson enjoyed it, so I suppose that's all that matters.